Grade 4 leaders, how are you? Hope you're doing well. Today, we're going to start a new big question, which is big question 9. Why are biomes important? By the end of this session, you'll be able to define and use words about biomes. Now, let's watch this video and try to guess why biomes are important. Biomes make our world interesting. Look at the beauty of nature, trees, and animals. There are two main types of aquatic biomes, freshwater and oceans. There are also many different types of biomes on land, forests, and the grasslands. Many different animals and plants live in each biome. Now, let's get ready to Unit 17 and let's listen to the words. Biome Desert Grassland Tropical Rainforest Temperate forest, taiga, tundra, freshwater, equator, sloth, cactus. Now, let's listen to the sentences and try to guess the meaning of each word. 1. Many plants and animals live in a biome. So, as we watched in the video, biome is a large natural community such as forest, desert, and ocean. 2. The air in the desert is often cool at night. So, desert, as we see in the picture, Desert is a large area of land, usually in hot region, where there is almost no water, rain, plants, and the trees. 3. The grassland is a perfect hiding place for a mouse. So, the grassland is a large open area of country covered with the grass, so the mouse can hide and no one can four the tropical rainforest receives more rain than any other so rainforest especially the tropical rainforest is a forest with high amount of rainfall five the temperate forest is full of colorful leaves in the autumn season so the temperate forest is a forest with high amount of rainfall and a variety of trees that lose their leaves during winter. 6. The taiga has green trees and white snow in winter. So, the taiga, the taiga is a moist forest dominated by conifers. These trees are called conifer. 7. Be sure to bring warm boots when you hike in the tundra. So tundra, as we see in the picture, is a treeless plain that consists of a black mucky soil. So it's necessary to bring boots with you. 8. A river or lake is a freshwater biome. So, a river is a freshwater biome because it contains fresh water. We can drink the water of the river. 
nine. It is usually warm and wet near the equator. So, the equator, as we see here in the picture, it's a great circle that divides the Earth into two equal parts. And the weather on the equator is warm because the sun shines straight on it. 10. The sloth moved through the tree very slowly. So the sloth, the sloth is a kind of a slow moving mammal. Here is the sloth. 11. A cactus doesn't need water every day. As we see in the picture, a cactus is a family of plants that branches with spines and are found in deserts. They don't need a lot of water. Hope you understood these words and I'm ready for all your questions. Don't forget to solve the exercises that I'll send as an attachment on your agenda. Goodbye.